Hi, welcome to our 11 free online course on AutoCAD Electrical Training. For today's lesson, we will learn about the reference file, title block, and template. In AutoCAD, external reference is also stand for the X reference. It's the feature that allows you to attach a drawing or other types of file to your current drawings as a reference. So we can try to type X reference, X R E F, enter, and this one will pop up. So we can click on this arrow drop down. So we can attach DWG image PDF from here. Let's try to attach a DWG and we can select a file from your PC. For example, I choose this motor circuit. Okay, okay. Now we can place the reference here. So if I want to make some changes in the original drawing, for example, I insert a component, push button, click on it, okay, repeat. The second component, okay, repeat, and the third component. Okay, so don't forget to save this drawing. Click the save button and go to the file again. So now the reference haven't added, but we will have a pop up here. So we can click on it to reload the S reference. So now it will highlight the changes. You can click on the arrow. It will bring you to the changes one by one. All right, now we can click the close button to exit it. Next, I will show you how to add attributes to a title block and make it as the template. First, draw your border in a new drawing. I will just use this as my border. Then, insert attributes in this title block. So we can type attdf, enter. And if I want to insert the number, number of sheets, so I just write the tag name as hashtag. Okay and place it in here. And for the rest, I will just copy the attribute for the rest. Click on it. So this is the total number of sheet. And I also do four lines for the title. Click on it. Right click. Double click to change the tag name, title one. And right click on it. Copy selection. Copy for the second line third line and the fourth line. Alright, double click on it, change it to title 2, OK. Title 3, OK. Title 4, OK. Alright, and this one I will change it to SHT. OK. Alright, then we can save this drawing by clicking this set button. Then we can go to the project tab. Under the other other two panel, click on the title block setup. Here has different options to set up the title block. I will use the method one project. Click the active drawing. OK. Alright, so now we can select the attribute to map to its corresponding project description line. For example, I want to map the title 1 to the project line, description line 1, the title 2 to the project description line 2. Click on the drawing value. Now I want to map the title 3 to the drawing description 1 and title 4 to the drawing description 2. And SH hashtag to the sheet value and SHT to the sheet maximum and click OK right so now we need to save this drawing again and let's try to add a new blank drawing type insert INSERT enter and click on this and browse for the template that we created just now, the drawing. Click on it, open. Well, well. And select this block and place it in our drawing. For example, I want to place it here. Click on it. Alright, and then we can go to the schematic tab. 
under the other two panel go to the drawing properties from here we can uh, modify the default setting for our drawing alright so after modify we can click OK then we need to save as this drawing click on the button and we need to choose the file type as the AutoCAD drawing template DWT click on it and the file name we can just put SEADE underscore template alright and then save it ok so now the template is done let's try to use the template to create a drawing now we close this drawing first and we go to the project manager and click this button to add a new drawing alright so the name I will just put SEADE01 and remember to change the template browse the, tem browse the template that we created just now the SEADE template and open ok now we want to insert the value for the attribute that we made just now if you still remember we insert 4 lines for the title and the number of sheets of the drawing and total number of sheets so the title 1 and 2 is the project, project description line 1 and 2 we can go to the project go to the project manager right click on the project description so let me type foc in line 1 and autocad electrical in line 2 alright so next I will go to the drawing right click properties drawing properties now I will insert the description line 1 as the drawing one and line two I will insert example and then OK alright and then don't forget to insert the sheet number also so go back to the drawing again right click properties drawing properties alright so key in the sheet value as number two and OK but if you see here the value of attributes do not appear yet we need to update the title block so we can go to the project tab go to the other two panels and click on the title block update alright select the all the attribute by one line two drawing description one and two the sheet number sheet maximum and the sequence and we can click ok project Y to apply for all the drawing in this project so we need to select the drawing so click shift and click another one click the process and ok alright now this one already added according the description that we set just now let's try to add another drawing using the same template SEADE02 and make sure here we are using the same template yeah the SEADE template and we can OK yes alright so from here if you can see the maximum number of sheets already become number 3 because here we have 3 drawing in this project so here but it haven't added yet so we need to go to the title block update and select the attribute again to add that the number of sheet ok click on the drawing hold shift and select the last drawing click the process ok so now as you can see the maximum number of sheet already become number 3 alright so that's all for today's lesson hope you learned something from this lesson thanks for watching this video and see you in the next lesson thank you